In less than two years, I built a multi six figure business. And here's three things that I had to get over and quit saying and quit thinking to get where I am. And I thought I would tell you and share this with you because these are the three biggest things. So the first one is the feeling of I don't belong. Like I can't take sp up space here. Like what I share isn't important enough. That could be when I walk into the room somewhere. That could be when I'm on social media. Feeling like I don't belong energetically is going to just make you feel smaller. And if you walk into the room being like, I belong here, I am just as important as anyone else, I am a boss, and you shift that mindset, and you're able to do that with your social media content as well, like I belong here, I belong, I, I deserve to get lots of views, I deserve for people to see what I have to share, I deserve for people to buy in, I deserve to have people in my DMs, I belong, something shifts. The second thing is, when you see someone doing well, it's not like how, you have to get rid of the idea of, oh, well, that's just for her or she was able to do that, but I can't. No, when I see someone else doing good or better than me in any way, I reposition that as, wow, that is evidence of what I am capable of creating in my own life. So instead of letting jealousy creep in or comparisonitis, if you can literally go, that's evidence of what I can do. If she can do this thing, then I can do this thing too. That is going to immediately shift the energy in yourself and in your business. And then the third thing is thinking, I can't afford that. Now when I want something, I just go get it. Because it's, now I never, I would never say to live outside of your means or to get into debt or anything like that. But I really don't live by a budget, which sounds absolutely insane. I do not waste money, but when I feel led and inspired to buy something, I buy it. Whether that's for my business or that's for pleasure. And I think that so many people put themselves on a rigid budget and you're constantly thinking of how much money is going out. And yeah, maybe you don't do it until you start to make more money, but on some level, even when you're not there yet, You've got to stop just looking at a budget and looking at numbers going in and out and panicking every day. Start focusing on how much more money you can bring in and not looking at what's going out. Constantly be focusing on what's coming in and celebrating that and being able to not hesitate, not hesitate to buy something with the energy of fear. Like if you can't buy something, whether it's chopstick or a bottle of water, if you can't buy it without having fear, then like don't buy it. But as soon as you can, can quit budgeting and get into the energy of this is normal for me.